Have you ever wondered why does your YouTube video sound is heard low compared to the original video on your computer or on your phone? That is might be because your video sound or the audio loudness of the video is not meeting the YouTube standard audio loudness. Well, you can check uh, your video uh, loudness simply simply by right click and hit start for nerds there uh, this is the volume and slash normalize content loudness minus 3.3 dB that means uh, that this video sound is 3.3 lesser than the standard of YouTube so how did you find out the standard of YouTube audio loudness well you can check this site is masteringthemix.com there you can see the list the platform and then the standard loudness and for YouTube here the BTP mean decibel through peaks and this one is loops loop stands for the loudness unit full scale so this two are standard for YouTube audio loudness so how to find out these two values to measure your audio well you can go here to ulin.co and install the ulin loudness meter it's free and you can also install the uh, PST plugin and I already installed it here and you can check the audio loudness simply by opening the application but it is not reading my sound you have to set it first click here reference and use system audio apply okay reset now I play this audio. Oke, langsung saja. Kali ini saya akan membahas seputaran asam humat atau humic. And of course, you can also check the video loudness. Just simply uh, open a video using a video player, and this Julian loudness meter will measure the sound or the loudness of the audio. And you can also find the Julian plugin here. I'm using the Vegas movie editor. Click here, fill, windows and loudness meter. Oops. Ini adalah pupuk KNO3 yang sudah dihaluskan. Lalu ini MK. Ini adalah pupuk KNO3 yang sudah dihaluskan. Lalu ini MKP. Ini gula. So this is the reference minus 17.4. So to gain uh, the YouTube standard, it has to reach 13 or 15 loops. Then you need to uh, gain the audio. So as simple as that. This is the reference loops and loops and dbtp. As for dbtp is uh, tp stand for true peaks and it's happened to me that I'm using Pegas here and it has already the uh, true peak meter and this is the true peak meter here ini gula dan ini urea yep so this is the reference that means uh, to gain minus one you need to uh, add more add more 0 0.8 dB here just measure it I mean just customize it to your reference so that's it that is the tricks to gain or to reach the standard audio log YouTube once again this is the reference and of course you can also find another reference for other platform as for YouTube is minus 
uh, 0.1 dBTP and 13 to minus 15 loops. And another trick, you can also use the audio for reference. I mean, no, this, uh, let's say I'm using the YouTube Pre Music. This audio is taken from the audio library from YouTube. Let's play it here. So the trick is, you can use this YouTube audio from YouTube audio library or another music or, or background sound and use it as a reference for your video or the audio of your video, I mean When you play it together, just make sure that the loudness is matched with this reference and one more thing, sometimes the uh, movie editor is compressing the audio when rendering or exporting. That means uh, sometimes they normalize this uh, high peak like this to make it equal with the previous wave and the volume is decreasing. So you need to add 2 or 3 more dB from the standard. So when the standard is minus 1 dB, just add plus 2 or plus 3 dB in case the audio is compressed. I think that will be all. Thank you very much for watching and see you.